Another new feature that I'd like to show you today is the concept mapping. If you click on the add-on that's right up here, this puzzle piece, not to be confused with this one over here, but this one up here, they're slightly different. You can click this little um, person's head with a, um, a concept map, I guess, in his head. And what will happen is you will get this box and it says double click to edit or circle ink images or text to create notes. So if I double click this, I could write sun. I could make myself a food chain. If I click my plus button, I automatically get a new node. So I could write grass. I have my producer here. If I wanted to, I could also take my pen on the smart board and I could write um, cow. And if I circle it, it will automatically become another um, part of my concept map. To draw lines between them, you simply connect like this. If you'd like to erase the connectors that you have between, just erase them like this. You can customize all your squares if you like. Again, I'll pick my selector tool. If I'm on my square, I can always go over to my properties tab on the right and I can customize it. I could make my square, uh, this is my color, I can make it red, blue, I can also right click on it and I can um, attach things as well this way. That is, oh, one more thing, the pictures. You can also take a picture and if I wanted oranges to be a part of my concept map, all I would need to do is drag that picture in. If I circle it, it will be made a part of my concept map and I can link it to my concept map. All the items in the concept maps can be wiggled around and moved and customized. Um, and that is custom um, concept maps in a nutshell.